Birmingham's an interesting place, I think, at the minute. You know, it's uh, lots of, you know, lots of investment going on into this city. Uh, it's a city with a rich sort of heritage of, uh, of music. And I think the uh, the development of the city, it's a really interesting time for it. Free Radio first contacted Miss Cheshire and seeing if she wanted to make a partnership, which would be a chance for our kids to perform, but also a chance for um, us to advertise Bo and get the word out in terms of what we do. We're, the, we're a big radio station at the heart of the city that's connected with a lot of the great things that are going on. I think um, musically, clearly, uh, we contribute in terms of uh, creating a great soundtrack to the city, but also clearly a lot of the events that happen around the city from a musical point of view. I was really excited to start and, and it would be challenging for a two week placement that's nine to five. I was really excited to get to know everyone, get to know how business works, especially a radio station and especially working in social media because I've done it before. I wanted to see what it was like in the professional industry. I was so overwhelmed with the whole, um, not only like the building, but like the way that the team was and like the way that they, they sort of like connected with each other so when we walked in like we were so welcomed and everyone was just like treating us like it was part of the team when you're looking to employ somebody in a radio station it is all about experience we'll see lots of people all the time that want jobs and and um, probably deserve a job in in radio and we see a lot of people that have been through education but haven't had any hands-on practical experience about it I think it's important for for businesses to be looking for the for the next generation of of talent. Well, the opportunities to work with such professional people. I don't think you realise how professional they are until so you get there and you realise, oh wait, that person's not from Boa. That's actually like a professional person. I think the students at Boa have a lot more opportunities than I ever had when I was at school. I mean, granted, I studied my GCSE in drama and did my A-level theatre studies, but there is no point that I would have ever been offered the opportunity to perform at an event in front of 15,000 people. But I cannot imagine what it must be like for those students. I did a string of things that I didn't do last year, um, obviously because they felt that I was more experienced and that I was more sort of opened up to the opportunity. I did a variety of marketing based um, pre-production work such as going and meeting clients, um, going and discussing pro forma briefs and um, sort of deciding marketing contracts between clients and, and, and actually free radio. Throughout my whole life I haven't done anything on the same level as this. You know, performing in front of so many people at such a big event is an amazing thing to do. When you see outside really close and you just see the free radio sign, you don't think actually what goes on behind the doors, like all of that. I didn't know it was that big and I didn't know that they had so many different departments doing so many jobs. Being able to shadow Sam and Mark through uh, the internship, like one of the days we just walked in, we weren't expecting it at all and um, the producer, he was like, so today you're going to be uh, shadowing some industry professionals. That was really good because I felt like even though Sam and Mark are TV presenters, um, like more so on the TV, being able to see them in radio on like the sort of flip side as well, I think that was an invaluable experience. I hope that they'll all come away with a confident view of their own abilities, the fact that we've given them the chance to share their ideas, bring, turn their ideas into stuff that is, is real, uh, some, some genuine experience of what it's like in a, say in a fast moving commercial business. They were really good with sort of pushing me, pushing the boat out, you know, they said right we're going to give you this massive job but we are here but we want you to do it so you learn how to do it and in effect you know they were teaching me really valuable skills. Only shadowing people and walking around looking at what they do, their jobs and all of that, I still picked up so much seeing what they do on a day to day basis and um, it's just crazy, a crazy overall experience. I would recommend it to anyone. And I'd say that over the past year is one of the best things that I've done. There's so many things, so I can't go into specifics, but they really have gave me like a solid understanding of a lot of the different elements that go into a marketing job. And like the contacts of it, to have the contacts in free radio and to have those people know your face is just something that is priceless. Like, that's what you need in this industry and that's what this has given you.